imagine if in 2024 I asked you not to use social media for a day? Won't it feel like an end to the entire world for a second? Now imagine for six days Pakistanis are not going to use social media. Yes, you heard it right. The Pakistan government plans to block all social media platforms like YouTube, WhatsApp, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok from July 13 to July 18. This decision aims to manage hate material during the holy month of Ramadan. Chief Minister Maryam Nawaz's Cabinet Committee on Law and Order recommended this ban to prevent misinformation and secretarian violence in Punjab a province served with over 120 million residents. Earlier, the Pakistan government had managed to block X, that was formerly known as Twitter, for more than four months. Now, Maryam Nawaz Punjab government has asked Shehbaz Sharif government to officially announce the suspension of all social media platforms on internet for six days. Here, let me remind you that Shehbaz Sharif is Maryam Nawaz's uncle. So, the decision can be in favour of her. Pakistan's Army Chief General Asif Munir has labelled social media as vicious media and emphasised the need to combat what he refers to digital terrorism. Deputy Prime Minister Ishaq Dar, who also serves as Foreign Minister, recently called for a complete ban on social media. Now, as I told you that earlier in Pakistan, X was banned. This action came after allegations from the Election Commission of Pakistan, which accused X of meddling in general election result. This move was seen as an effort, possibly directed by the military, to prevent Imran Khan's party, Pakistan's Tariq Insaf, from gaining the power. Since former Prime Minister Imran Khan was removed via a non-confidence vote in April 2022, both the military and Pakistan government has faced criticism on social media. Now, as Pakistan implements this temporary ban, debates continue on how best to balance security concern with the right to free expression in the digital age. For more such information, do follow India.com's International Affairs.